Well, sports can teach us one of life's most valuable lessons. Don't ever give up. For one state championship winning coach, his biggest test comes outside the lines. WCBI's Tom Ebel shares the story of Coach Bruce Franks, who knows there's more to life than titles and rings. Standing six feet seven inches, there aren't many things bigger than Hebron Christian head basketball coach Bruce Franks. What's my nickname? B. The only thing taller may be his list of accomplishments. Six state titles, more than 20 district titles, and more than 1,000 career wins. But his biggest challenge comes beyond the court. Franks continues his battle against cancer. Due to his health, Franks is stepping away from the game he's coached for 37 years. Right now, my record is 1,398 and I think 646. So 1,400 would be a pretty good milestone. But, you know, that's okay. Um, you know, my health is, is what's important right now, and I have, to, I have to get back where I need to be. Well, at first, whenever we saw Coach Franks, he was kind of intimidating because he was, like, really big. And, but once we got to know him, he's more like a big teddy bear. The Lady Eagles senior class has spent the last five years playing for Coach Franks, winning back-to-back -back state championships. It was a lot more difficult this year because Coach Franks got cancer. He wasn't always here with us, but I think that we won the second one uh, mainly for him. It's really hard to see him like go through it. Like my grandmother had cancer, and so like I kind of knew what to expect, you know. And so you know to like go and give them a hug every day and just kind of build them up because you know that they're down because I mean they have cancer and they don't know if they'll make it through the day. It's the simple hug or the pat on the back that helps Coach Franks day by day, but the biggest support comes from his biggest fan, his wife Linda. She is my best friend. She is my worst critic. I think she's missed one game in 37 years, and it was my fault, but uh, we got over that. And so a family, a team, and a community continues to root for the coach that's brought so much success to Hebron Christian. Although Franks will be stepping down from his post as head coach, he leaves behind lessons that go far beyond the X's and O's. You have to fight for what you love, and Coach Franks definitely loved basketball, and he f he's fought to be here, and he's fought for it, and he hasn't let uh, cancer hold him back at all. I'm a fighter. I'm not a quitter, so I'm not ever going to quit at anything. Uh, anybody ever played in sports, I'm going to play that last second. I hope some kids saw that, hey, he's down a little bit, but he didn't give up, and the same thing may happen to them a little bit later on. If coach can do it, I can do it. Reporting in Phoebe. Tom Ebel, WCBI Sports. Phenomenal story. Thank you, Tom. Now, Frank says he has three more scheduled appointments with doctors to hopefully defeat his illness. The Hebron Christian community held a benefit this past weekend, raising more than $7,000. And we wish him and the entire Hebron Christian and Houston community the very best in the fight against Coach Frank's cancer. That's all.